And now it's time for some exercise. But I'm not talking about jogging, doing sit-ups, playing tennis, or any of those kinds of physical activity. What I am talking about is a form of exercise that might be beneficial for your eyesight. Sound intriguing? Well, let's find out all about it. Estimates are that at least 100 million Americans now wear eyeglasses to correct some form of vision impairment. And the overwhelming majority admit that if they didn't have to wear those eyeglasses or contact lenses, they definitely would not do it. All of which begs the question of what can one do to eliminate the need for glasses? Well, obviously surgery is one solution, but there is another much less evasive procedure that some swear really does work for almost any kind of vision impairment. Believe it or not, it involves the use of the mind and exercise of the eyeball. And if that sounds strange, allow me to introduce you to an organization in El Cajon, California, known as the Vision Training Institute. It's run by a Dr. Jerry Ann Tabor, and she specializes in teaching what is known as aerobics. She told me what it was all about. It's physical therapy for the eyes. It was developed by ophthalmologist William H. Bates. Dr. Bates was a noted surgeon and um, ophthalmologist. And he became very dissatisfied with the fact that when glasses were put on the eyes, the eyes only got worse. They didn't get better. And he asked the question, why, if glasses are correct, must they continually be strengthened while the eyes, under their influence, have become weakened? Doctor, in this period of time, how many people do you think you've been able to help? Thousands. I have never really stopped and counted, but thousands of people. And is it effective for most people, regardless of what kind of vision problem they have? I've never had anyone who has not improved their vision, depending how long they stay. Everyone gets better. Is it effective for most people? Yes, aerobics is effective for all types of vision problems. Nearsighted, farsighted, astigmatism, lazy eye, which is a coordination problem. Um, another word for that is strabismus, uh, cataract, glaucoma, nystagmus. Because it works with the cause, not the symptoms. The symptoms are typically dealt with by putting glasses on, which allows a person to see and function but it doesn't improve their condition. Now, I'll admit, I have heard of virtually every kind of exercise under the sun, but never have I heard of exercising your eyeballs to improve your vision. It's just amazing the things we are learning about how to improve our health and physical fitness on this show.